Assalamu alaikum. Hi everyone. In this video uh, tutorial, you will see some simple steps used to create the Lone Mesh in Rhino Grasshopper. Um, as you can see, you will be able to adjust the number of faces using the number slider. You will also be able to adjust the thickness of the structure, the edges of the faces. In addition, you will also be able to adjust the color of the mesh, as you can see. Now I'm turning off the layers to start the whole thing from the beginning. So first I will create a box in Rhino. And then I'm going to create, uh, to connect this box to uh, Grasshopper using the thread component. Then I will use uh, Populate 3D to create some random points inside the box. And as you can see, um, uh, uh, I'm using the number slider uh, for the count. Uh, the count is very important because it decides the number of uh, faces in the mesh. And here I will use the Delaunay mesh uh, component. Uh, then uh, I'm going to um, uh, turn off the prep layer the prep component preview of and here inside Rhino I'm going to also to hide uh, the box I've created at the beginning as you can see uh, here we adjust uh, the number of uh, faces the number of ages uh, uh, points of the Delaunay mesh then I will use uh, Delaunay ages and uh, I will connect uh, the population, the population to the points. I'm using this component to, to create the structure of the mesh. Um, and here I will use the pipe component and connect the edges, the edges to the curve. And here I will adjust uh, the radius to be suitable for uh, the structure or the scale or the size of uh, the mesh. Then I will use uh, the custom preview and uh, we'll connect the mesh to the geometry and uh, we'll use um, a color, uh, um, color swatch or color picker. Here I'm using color swatch and I will connect it to material. And uh, as you can see here, we can adjust uh, the number of uh, faces, uh, the number of uh, cells inside the mesh. And here uh, we, we, we can start uh, uh, using the, the color also to, uh, to color uh, the edges, the structure of uh, the mesh. And here you click uh, on the color and choose uh, whatever you like. And uh, you can adjust the radius. And also you can adjust the color of uh, the faces. Um, so I hope you enjoyed uh, this video uh, tutorial and thank you for watching.